Hello everyone. In this part, we are going to solve part number E. Again, you have to find the compounders and the amount on rupees ten thousand. Here, the principal is rupees ten thousand. Rate here is eight percent per annum compounded half yearly, and the time is one year. Again, we know that if the compounders is payable half yearly. Then the rate will become half, or you can say rate will become four times, and the time will become twice, or you can say it is two times. Means if the interest is half yearly, in a year interest will be payable two times, and the rate, if the rate is yearly eight percent, obviously after six months the rate will be paid at four percent. Simply. Again, you can put the value on this formula. Here, the value of principal is one zero 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 zero, and one plus rate is actually four uh, percent and hundred. And here, time is two times. Solving this, this can be cancelled out twenty five times. So. Here, if we take the LCM, it will be 26 upon 25 square. Further solving this, we have 26 into 26 upon 25 into 25. This is four times zero zero. Again, when this is cancelled out, is 16 times. So 26 multiplied by 26 multiplied by 16 is actually one zero. Eight one six rupees. We know that the square of twenty six, and when multiplied by sixteen, we get this. So this will be our amount. And if you want to find the compound interest, we can subtract ten thousand from one zero eight one six minus ten thousand. So eight one six will be the compound interest. Rupees eight one six will be your compound interest for this particular question. Thank you.